Question 14, you're told that you can use this conversion graph to change between pounds and dollars. Okay, um, use the conversion graph to change five pounds to dollars. So make sure you're along the pounds axis, you know it's five pounds. So you mark yourself five here. And it's very important you draw the lines. You must draw the lines in the exam to show the examiner it's what's called interpolation, how you got the answer from the graph. So you draw a line up, you draw a line across, and it's eight dollars. Okay, so write down eight dollars. It gives you the dollar sign for you. Part B. Ella has two hundred dollars, and she's got eight hundred pounds. Her t her hotel bill is six hundred dollars. Ella pays the bill with two hundred dollars and some of the pounds. Use the conversion graph to work out how many pounds she has left. Let's write down some of the information. Her hotel, uh, she pays the hotel bill with $200 and some of the pounds. So her hotel bill is uh, six, uh, $600, okay? So $600, subtract the $200 she pays, uh, is $400. And that's how much she, she owes with her pounds, with pounds left. Okay, now looking back on the conversion graph, think about what they told you. They told you five pounds was eight dollars. You know that five pounds is the same thing, okay, as eight dollars. So what is four hundred dollars? Well, firstly, what's forty dollars? Forty dollars is five times as much. So that must be 25 pounds. So $400 must be 10 times more than that, which is 250 pounds. Okay, so the $400, this is the same. So for, you can say that $400 is the same thing as 250 pounds. Now she has 800 pounds. So left over would be her 800 pounds subtract 250 pounds. Take away 200 is 600, take away 50 is equal to 550 pounds. So it's 550 pounds left over. For me, the key to this question was just to get started. Obviously, you know $400 is left after she's paid with her $200, you've got 400 left. And then think about why did they ask me part A? That's a useful bit of information and really handy to be able to work out an easy conversion for you. And we're done.